Hi beauties, welcome back. So today I'm really excited. This is a company, we're doing an unboxing of a subscription box. This is a company that reached out to us and we've been working with them uh, for quite a while now. And I'm really, really excited uh, that they are continuing to, to wanna work with us because I really like their boxes. This is Look Fantastic and it is a UK based uh, beauty subscription box. It is $16 a month, I believe or $20 a month maybe. But currently they're running a sale. So if you do, uh, if you sign up and you do a month, um, a month, a year long subscription, you can get your first box for a dollar. And then every box after that is going to be $16. So a really affordable beauty box. And I was super excited with what uh, December's was really cute. They did like a whole like, their box designs are always so gorgeous. So that's why I always wait to like open it up because they send you like the little shipping box. And then when you open it up, you actually get to like see the actual design of the box. It's kind of like, like I saved their boxes because they're just so precious. Um, it's kind of like the Ipsy bag. All right, so it's a cute little peach box this time. Inside, we have the book that gives us the breakdown of the products that you could get and the prices for everything. Yes, they're great about like, what is it? How do you use it? I don't, I actually don't know if they do give prices. Yeah, no, they don't have prices. That's fine, it's fine, we don't need it, anyway. I do believe that they say each box is valued at at least $60, um, and then certain boxes they say, oh, this one is in, is a special one and it's worth like $100 or $150. But they value at at least $60 each time. So, first thing I see is just, I love that they do like the little paper. They just make it so cute. It's like opening it like an Easter bag. I'm gonna pull everything out to make sure that I get everything and then we're gonna talk about them one by one. First thing we have is a Balance Me AHA Glow Mask. Uh, I love it. I love AHA based products. The first time I used it was from The Origins, uh, which is like a super affordable skincare line that is carried, I think at several places, but I know Ulta carries it. Um, I started using their AHA and BHA like peeling mask and it, when you put it on, it looks like you're wearing blood and then it like, it dries down and then you wipe it off. And I, I love it, freaking love it, does wonders. So I'm really excited to try out this glow mask because I'm, I'm hoping it's gonna do some one. My skin's been acting up lately, even though I like very rarely wear makeup anymore. It's just like, we're, you're still gonna break out, so it's fine. So I'm hoping that this might be able to go in and kind of help that. But yeah, so uh, definitely a tiny size sample, but I think you probably could get like at least two uses out of it, uh, which, I think is a good way to test out to see if it's something that you would wanna buy. Um, the next thing we have is from Elmas. I love Elmas. Elmas is a one of my favorite brands. Started discovering them through like BoxyCharm and I think Ipsy's done a couple Elmas products now as well, but I really like their stuff. And this is a papaya enzyme peel, which is an, it's a, an enzymatic cream exfoliator and it's advanced skincare. It's supposed to exfoliate, purify, tired, lackluster skin. It's like, they know me. Uh, yeah, so I'm excited about this one too. It looks like definitely this one is going to be like a very skincare heavy box. I like that at the beginning of the year because my skin is always really bad in the winter. Like it's super chapped. I need a lot of things to try and help it. And I, I don't know if the, like the fact that it's chapped causes me to break out more, but I just seem to break out a lot during this time of year as well, so. The next thing we have is from Ico and this is a galactic lid gloss. <gasps> oh! This is a cream eyeshadow. I love cream eyeshadows. If you guys have been with me for a while, you know I love, oh, like the Ciate London ones are some of my favorites. Oh, it's so bright. So much came out. I did not want that much to come out. No, don't waste it. All right, I'm gonna put it next to the swatches of lip color I have. From, no, I'm gonna do it on the other hand because of the way I have it. Oh, it's pretty. I hope you guys can see that. I know it's far away and I know it's only a little bit, but I didn't want to waste too much, but really pretty coppery color. And then when you rub it in, it just gives you like this really nice like copper reflectiveness. Love it. I'm super jazzed about that. Liquid eyeshadows are literally one of my favorite things. Once again, tiny sample, but still with this, it's so pigmented and they're so, I think you can get a lot of it out of, you can get a lot of uses out of this little bad boy. Okay, so the next thing we have is actually a mini version of something that I have a full size of that I love. This is the Ilma Squat Beyond the Veil Skin Glowing Gel. I'm a huge fan of Ilma Squat as well. Um, there's just a lot, they've got a lot of really nice skincare like brands featured in this box, which I'm, I'm loving, I'm loving that. It smells really good too. So this is actually different than what I have. I thought it was the same product, I'm wrong. What I have is a primer. This is actually a moisturizer that is supposed to uh, hydrate. 
and give you a nice like sheen to your skin. So this would be something I probably would use under a, a primer. And it does, when you look at it, it does give you like this kind of, it's like a champagne-y color. Oh, I'm gonna drop it. It's like a champagne-y color. So you definitely can see like where it's got like the little bit of like, I don't know. <laughs> it reminds me of my mom used to buy this. It used to be from like Bath and Body Works and like, you know, the early 2000s, but it was like this, like, it was a spray that had like tanning stuff in it and you would like, it'd like settle on the bottom and you'd like shake it up and you'd get like, like the glitter. Like that's the vibe I get from that. It's like, like the, the glitter. <laughs> it's not what it is, but that's, wow, nostalgia. I think it smelled like coconuts too. I don't, whatever, whatever, it doesn't matter. <laughs> anyway, all right, moving on. Uh, the next thing we have is a bubble strawberry macaroon hand and body butter. If you guys watch me, you know, I'm really not jazzed normally about getting creams like that, like like skincare, I mean, uh, not skincare, like hand creams and like foot creams and things. I just, not really my thing. I'm too lazy to ever remember to use them. So eh. that being said, my hands are incredibly chapped. So it's not that it's not necessary. It's just something that I don't love, but it's a really nice size. I mean, that is a great, like decent size, a lot of use clearly that you guys can get out of it uh, or that you could get out of it. And um, it's also small enough that you could still like slip it in a handbag, so. I like it, I wanna smell it because strawberry macaroon smells, or sounds int intriguing. I'm intrigued by it. Ooh, it is, it is potent. This also smells like something from my childhood and I, it, okay, okay. I, ha, I, I, I had like a Barbie Easy Bake Oven and I think it smelled like one of the cake mixes. I'm pretty sure that's what that smell is reminding me of right now. Interesting, anyway. Final product we have is a Magnetone London Wipeout Swipes. It's a two pack. These are uh, eco-friendly microfiber makeup removal pads. I've gotten a couple of these. Uh, oh, wow. Okay, so I've gotten a couple of these type things from other companies before, but these are like thick boys. Like these actually seem like I would like them more than the ones that I've gotten in the past. Um, the ones that I've gotten in the past are really like just little cloth basically exactly what you think of when you think of like a cotton pad, like it's just a cloth version of it. These are more like my glove hair towel that they sent me in my very first uh, Look Fantastic box, like that thick microfiber. I'm actually really excited to try these. I think these will really do a nice job of um, being able to go in and like remove water or uh, remove makeup, like especially if you have like a micellar water or something to go with it, so yeah. Love the box, super cute. Definitely check them out if you haven't. Uh, I love getting Look Fantastic boxes. I just, they've been really great to work with. They're super great and um, yeah, I'm excited. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. If you like us, then subscribe because you've been here this long, might as well. Other than that, I hope you guys are all safe and healthy. You have a wonderful day and you stay girly with a dark twist.